The Duggar kids have been working hard at carving out their own independent career paths. Ginger Duggar and her husband, Jeremy Vuolo, have launched a podcast, and Jessa Duggar has taken to posting content to YouTube. Much of her content revolves around life with her three children and her husband, Ben Seewald. While Jess's YouTube content has gotten mostly praise from family followers, her Instagram content is a different story entirely. In recent weeks she's attempted to make the hashtag, hash sayings of Spurgeon, happen, and family critics think she's making up more than half of what she claims the four-year-old is actually saying. Jess's three kids are cute. There is no arguing that. Jessa has spent a fair amount of time featuring both Spurgeon Seawald and Henry Seawald on both Instagram and YouTube. Jessa's youngest daughter, Ivy Jane Seawald has also begun appearing in her content regularly, too. There doesn't seem to be anything strange about that, but a few followers have taken issue with some of Spurgeon's alleged sayings. Family followers first took issue with the notion that Jessa's young son specifically asked to take his hymn book on a recent walk. According to Jess's anecdote, Spurgeon asked to take the book so he could sing to the animals along the way. While the story seems cute, family critics on Reddit strongly believe the story was manufactured so that Jessa would have content. She shared another tale suggesting that Spurgeon connected the S in his name to Salt. Again, Reddit users strongly believe it never happened. Family followers are also worried that Jessa appears to favor Spurgeon Some critics have voiced concern about the way Jessa parents her three children. According to critics, Jessa appears to favor Spurgeon, or, at the very least, seems to feature him more regularly on both YouTube and Instagram. That may be more about the children's ages than actual favoritism, though. Jess's second child, Henry, recently turned three, however, he is reportedly experiencing some speech delays. Her youngest child, Ivy Jane, just turned one in May. Since both Henry and Ivy are younger than Spurgeon, they are, obviously, less verbal. Jessa may feature Spurgeon more heavily, simply because he has more to say. Thank you for watching our video.